Hi, Brent Tech here. Where tech is made simple. So last week in one of our most recent polls on the channel, I asked you the question, do you use Microsoft Defender on Windows or a third-party antivirus? Now, out of the 491 votes already cast, as you can see, the majority of you, 79%, say, yes, you do use Microsoft Defender on Windows, and 21% of you say, no, uh, you use a third-party antivirus on Windows. Now, in regards to this poll, um, a couple of days ago, I did post a video that according to a recent test by AV Test, um, Microsoft Defender had the worst performance compared to other antivirus products. And I'll leave a link to that video down below if you would be interested. Now, um, what I thought we could do today, um, just to finish off looking at this poll, um, is just to have a look at a recent real-world protection test that was conducted between February and March of this year by AV Comparatives, who's not to be confused with AV Test. AV Comparatives is another anti-malware testing firm. And I thought we could have a look at their recent real-world protection test results, which were also um, conducted on and tested on a Microsoft Windows 10 Pro 64-bit operating system. And according to AV Comparatives, the results are based on the test set of 260 live test cases and URLs pointing directly to malware. And they also say that this is more or less the same infection vectors that are used as a typical user would experience in everyday life. Now, if we just head over to AV Comparatives results, here we get the different antivirus products that they did test at the bottom. And it seems that Microsoft Defender has done a little bit better um, according to AV Comparatives. Now, um, yeah, we can see, and if you look at the little window at the top, um, we can see that um, Microsoft Defender blocked 100% of the threats and only had two false positives. And if we head over to Bitdefender as another example, um, compared to Microsoft Defender, it also blocked 100% of the threats, but only had one false positive, which was exactly the same as Total Defense, also blocked 100% of the threats and had one false positive. So not bad um, regarding Microsoft Defender, which um, was exactly the same, but only had um, two false positives. Now, according to um, Panda and the results for Panda, um, which had 19 false positives, um, which is quite extreme, actually. Um, I don't think Microsoft Defender did actually too bad. And if we have a look at Kaspersky, which um, scored top marks, um, it basically had no false positives. It blocked 100% of the threats, nothing user-dependent, and nothing was compromised. So according to AV Comparatives, Kaspersky uh, is the best antivirus product and solution when it comes to their real-world protection um, threats and tests that they threw and um, conducted on the different antivirus products and solutions. And as mentioned, Microsoft Defender, I don't feel, did too bad according to these test results. Now, one thing just to take note of, as I always do mention, um, although these um, test results do give us a good indication, they will never be 100% accurate. So there will be a couple of discrepancies. Um, so always just keep that in mind. Now, when it comes to the poll, my personal opinion is that I use Microsoft Defender on my Windows devices, and I have for many years. And I've always said, and I'm, I've said this on the channel numerous times, so I'm just going to say it again today. Um, if you are an average home user and you are practicing good computing habits and you're not visiting dodgy sites, then I personally feel that if you are spending money on a third-party antivirus product and solution, um, then you are wasting your money. Um, if you are using Microsoft Defender, as mentioned, as an average home user and as stated, um, then I personally think your system will be fine. I have used Microsoft Defender for years and have not had no issues when it comes to the protection of both my Windows 10 and now my Windows 11 devices. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.